Hey guys, this is Ken, and we're back in my garage. I'm working on my 46 Ford truck running boards, and I was having troubles finding a bolt to fit in these holes. These are squares, half inch square carriage bolt hole with a 5 16 nut or a hole through the center. Now I checked all online, everywhere. Uh, I checked the forums, nobody seems to be confining. Now this is a carriage bolt with a half inch shoulder, but it's a uh, 7 16 inch thread. There's no way that fits through that hole. Here we have a carriage bolt with 5 16 thread, which will fit through that hole, but you can see the shoulder, there's no way that, that square is gonna stop that from spinning. It's just gonna rattle around in there. So that's not gonna work either. So what, what do you do? Well, you get these things. I got these from Tacoma Screw. It's called, a, they called it an FRP T-nut. It's threaded on the inside. Got a Torx head fitting on this side. It's about an inch and an eighth in diameter. Drops right into that hole. And because it's got a Torx head, I use my Torx head uh, driver. Sits right in there. I keep it from spinning. Then I use a half inch, 5 sixteenths, 5 sixteenths coarse thread, half inch long bolt with a, nut, with a washer on it. Stick that right up through the bottom. Put my nut on there. It's in. And it's down, and it didn't crush my running board because these have a shoulder on them. The only issue you might have is the shoulders are a little bit long. In fact, the one I just put in, I think, has the long shoulder. Let me get that out of there and take a look. Probably grabbed the wrong one. There's the difference. You have to cut your shoulder down. This barrel, I guess, is what it would be called. I got a burr on that one still. Cut the barrel down, bring it down to just over a quarter inch, and then it will sit. Once you tighten it down, it sits right flush on the top of your top of your running board and doesn't squash it. So this works perfectly. It looks almost factory, uh, except for the torque set on the top, but I'm going to powder coat mine black, actually textured black, so it won't rust. It'll look good, and it'll hold the running boards down just like it's supposed to be without crushing them. I think this is a good solution to the problem. Let me know what you think, guys.